previously on my part one vlog on our honeymoon in bali i showed you guys arriving in bali after that i showed you guys i give you guys a tour of the villa we're staying at a complete luxury loved it after that showed you guys spending time with my husband having breakfast in the pool it was too cute after that we went off um to play with turtles and my husband had the best time and i was freaking out most of the time played with snakes and whatnot and after that we went to visit the uluwatu temple to catch a sunset and that's where we ended off so we're gonna pick up from there and then do a part two enjoy Sweating. We're sweating. Guys, we were chasing the sunset. Oh, sorry, we got we here a bit, a bit late. We got a glimpse of the sun. If you can oh show them there, Goose. Just show them a bit that side. A little bit. A little bit, bit but... <laughs> yep. But we... We definitely coming back next week. Yes, we're we, coming yeah. back with August next week. Yeah, we're coming back with we'll August. We'll come on time. Thank you, thank you. Oh, guys, we're, tired. we're so tired running up the stairs up and down the stairs so we're going back we're going up the stairs again so we'll see you guys next we week we need to get something to eat we, we, where are you taking us we, what are we getting to eat it's uh, just on the way back okay on the way back. Yeah, on our okay. way back we'll we'll stop somewhere get we're some getting food. Balinese. Balinese. Food. No seafood there's a, actually there's a seafood restaurant at the uh, at the temple but not we're not going for that we're going for Pure local, local Balinese food. Yay. See you guys next time. <laughs> hey guys, so um, Agus dropped us off at this other restaurant. Eating a baby lapa. Can't see. Beja. Bejana. 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 Uh, oh, here it is. Over the. Bejana. Bejana. <laughs> Um, so we're going to, going to get like, but we wanted like proper Balinese food. So we're going to get food here. We're walking in now. Let's get dinner. I'm so tired. <laughs> uh, oh, I hope the food is nice. The place is gorgeous. Let's sit here. Oh. Martin. This is for you. Yeah. Oh, thank you, Ben. It's fine. This place is hot. It's very hot. It's, it's hot and humid. So I'm starving. I'm starving. I just want food. Yeah. I'm honestly. I'm going to be full. Chicken satay. Come on, see what I'm ordering. Satay. spice chicken served with Balinese mixed vegetables and white rice and Balinese. Guys, so we just ordered um, Balinese food, like local specials. I have no idea what I just bought. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, I just ordered something that that sounds nice on the menu. <laughs> but let's let's try it out. Let's be open-minded and 
hopefully we'll enjoy the food yes because um there's like salmon tuna steak salmon like steak barbecue spare weeds like burgers and stuff like that but we don't want that like we want we could have this at home really let me show you but this restaurant is a bit um pricey but yeah can we for a surprise interesting dun, 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 dun. Can't wait. thank you Thank you. Did you stroll? No. Yes, please. Yeah. Hope you enjoy. Thank you. So smart. <laughs> yes. Okay, I thought I was gonna take your drink. Oh, she didn't yeah. taste mine. Help me go there. Thank you. Thank you. My meal looks delicious. I ordered chicken satay and it looks so good. I can't wait to dig in. We're going to taste each other's nails. But this is how mine looks. Oh, Baby, what did you order? Mi goreng. I got the mi goreng. It's basically just chicken breast, uh, noodles, and some side up egg and cashew nuts. So guys, I'm tasting my meal. Let me start with the noodles. Uh, let me move the egg to the side. Let me... They look dry. They look dry. Let me... The noodles are nice, but it's a bit dry. Yeah. yeah. There's sauce missing, but they're nice. I'm happy. The boobs are booming, guys. So I'm having the um, beef sachet. Chicken sachet. Oh, chicken sachet, yeah, not beef. So I'm just gonna pour, let me show you. It's sweet. Please permit. Mm. Mm -hmm. It's so nice. You should have ordered this. You should have ordered that, man. Yeah? It looks nice. Oh. Only my drink is disappointing, but this. Enjoy, it, baby. So hi guys, we just finished eating, so we asked for the bowl, and this is our bowl. Like it's two meals and two drinks. This roughly amounts to 403, I think 400 and something. Yeah, that's quite cheap compare our standards towards this you won't get a meal like two meals and two drinks in Cape Town for 400, for 400 and something so let's go pay guys hey husband we are home it's been a long day <laughs> we actually we, we, we did a half day too, but it feels like imagine doing a full day and we left here around 2, ne? We left, yeah. It's 9 now. Like 20 to 2. 
okay guys my teeth are rotten <laughs> What's your best sweet, right? <laughs> Sweets and chocolates. Oh, I just saw the little pictures of them. Almost all of them at the back. You need either feeling or to be taken out. Um, last night we came here around 10. I was in so much pain. I wanted to die. And then they said um, they are closing. We must come back tomorrow. I got some painkillers. And at least that helped. And then tell them we drove the whole of that. Okay. Yeah, we drove everywhere looking for grandpa. They don't have grandpa this side. <laughs> and I think the reason I took so long is because every time I put like grandpa on the tooth, it stops. Mm. So now that I'm on this side, there's no grandpa. <laughs> so there's no way to stop the pain. So I'm so happy because it feels me to come to a doctor and yeah, I'd have to take out my tooth on my honeymoon. The get up. <laughs> She'd be at a beach club drinking. <laughs> yeah, I need the dentist. Yeah, but the doctors here are so kind and so informative. I feel safe. Mm. But the people. Yeah, everyone in Bali is so kind and so sweet. See you during my operation. <laughs> All right. So this is tooth number eight, and this is tooth number seven, and here the black area is where the decay is. Yes. So definitely, we need to do. An extraction on this tooth. Okay. Okay. So this one here, in terms of the root, I don't see any um, bending or anything on the root. So I think we could try to take it out today. I'll do it very gently, softly. Okay. Just try to do a bit of a wiggle. Um, but there is always a risk of fracture because of how big the decay is. If I press too hard or anything like this, this can break. And fracture. Okay. So what's gonna happen if it breaks and fractures? <laughs> <laughs> so we try to avoid that from happening, but I just need to tell you all the risks involved with extraction. Okay. No. Okay. You can take it out. Yeah, this one also a little bit broken. It's really, really, really fragile to start off with because the decay is really big. But yeah, I try to take it out really softly so there is not much of um, yeah other cuts and unnecessary cuts. Okay, so it will slowly close off. Normally with the top tooth, it doesn't hurt as much as the bottom one. So now just make sure after you eat, you do a gargle with water and a little bit of salt just to get that food out if it if it gets in but just take your medication it will kataflon sama prolip just take your medication and you'll be healing fine but expect a little bit of pain after the anesthesia wears off which is really normal um, as I've just taken out a tooth and a big one Okay, any other questions? No, you did well by the way. Thank you. <laughs> I would say we were good together.
together, yeah There ain't nothing better, yeah Let's hold this like it's now or never, ever, ever, yeah You and me are tethered like forever, ever, ever, yeah I can see you with my eyes closed I can feel you near In the next room over, over When you're not here My fire when it gets cold Atmosphere Burning up when you come close I hope you never disappear I'll be in it till stars go Quitting and even Then I'm with you When things go dark I'll be where you are We can make it if you want to Do you want to start a new career in YouTube and become a successful YouTuber? Or do you want to go into online teaching? Or do you simply want to improve your skills in your current career? Jumpstart your 2023 goals now with this exclusive offer from Skillshare. So try Skillshare for free for 7 days and get 20% off your first year. My first lesson for the year is by Fadi Kore and it's on successful and practical negotiation. The reason I'm taking this class is because you guys know that I am a content creator. I create content for brands for both YouTube and Instagram and most of the time I found it so hard to negotiate a good price that I'm happy with. I end up working harder and getting paid less so I'm using Skillshare to teach me how to negotiate and have like proper skills for negotiating and the price that I'm helping with uh, so I did the introduction and they explained to me what is negotiation and they explained to me how my body language should be and my positional bargaining so I highly advise for you guys to kickstart your careers through this year with Skillshare whatever you are interested in it's available on Skillshare click on the link in my description box to get seven days free of skills share and then get 20 percent off your first year enjoy <laughs> good morning guys um it is half past nine in the morning in bali let me check what time is it at home i'm sure it's like the am's something it's half past three in Cape Town and it's half past nine here. Uh hubby is in the shower, he's getting he's taking a shower. I um, I only washed my face and brushed my teeth for breakfast. I'm gonna go swim. We're gonna have like breakfast in the pool. So I want to first eat and then take a shower. But he wants to what am I doing? Now I look fine. You guys must remind me to tell you the story of this duck, of how much I got in trouble for buying this duck. But I'm not going to address that now. Oh, thing. Oh, 
I was saying eh, we're going to have breakfast now yesterday we went out my husband bought me a coach bag for my birthday it's my birthday in five days in five days it's my birthday and he bought me a coach bag i've been uh, hinting the whole year and he finally bought it for me i bought a few stuff at victoria's secret but i am going to unbox for you for, but right now i want to change and wear my swimsuit and wait for breakfast in the pool um then we'll talk a bit more after that but um we also have uh like a day trip a half day trip at at one at one and it's half past nine now so we made it at one because we don't want to wake up in the morning and rush and stuff we want to relax want to relax enjoy our breakfast and 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 if you guys I think you guys might get lucky. I'm thinking of doing a shit in haul in this vlog and just quickly show you what I bought a shit in. Uh, that green set I was wearing yesterday, I'm gonna put a picture here. I bought it a shit in. There's a pink one too. So, yeah, guys, um, let us have breakfast. Let me change so that when breakfast gets here, I'm ready. And then we'll talk after breaky breaky. I'm going to take a nice bath after breakfast. Okay, let's have breaky. We're going to eat after that. Um, I'm going to shower and then I'm going to unbox the stuff for you and then close off this vlog. Let me show you what we're having for breakfast. This is my breakfast. I have beef bacon. I don't know if I don't know. I think that's a fish cake. I don't know. Mushrooms, spinach, egg, and bread. Happy is having a breakfast wrap. It's delicious. <laughs> First time we're having a breakfast wrap. I've had this before, and we're both having like Coke. Ah, <sighs> and. It's not sunny outside, so having breakfast in the pool would have been a good idea, but we're so tired. <laughs> we're tired. Today's rest day. I'm just going to unbox and literally just close the vlog. And we're going to stay in bed, swim, eat, sleep. The vibes. The vibes. Okay. Okay, let me eat and then I'll see you guys once I've bathed and ready to unbox. So I'm about to unbox my coach bag. Actually, I came here to close off this vlog. It's three weeks later. I think I bought this bag um, the first time when we got to Bali, the first week that we got to Bali and I haven't opened it because I really, really wanted to unbox with you guys. But you know, when you're on holidays, things keep happening. Some days I'm lazy, some days we're just sleeping and time just flew. We even went to Singapore and i bought a second coach bag i can't believe it myself me authentic bags you know um 
someone asked me on my um, Instagram DMs and they were like, um, so is Mickey not good enough now that you're buying authentic bags? And that is not the case at all. Guys, listen, as people, we start somewhere. Just because I'm st I started somewhere, it doesn't mean I'm not supposed to grow and elevate from that. Same as you, when you feel like, okay, uh, I'm currently not in the position to get um, a luxury item, you can simply just go to Mr. Price, Edgar's, Guess, anything that you can afford at that moment and work with it, even if it's a replica. That's what I did. And the main reason is, you guys know now, is because we were saving for a wedding and we wanted to pay for our wedding cash. And it really cost like a lot of money. And we were also saving for our honeymoon. And that's also like a lot of money. So now I have a little bit of more cash to play around with. <laughs> so um, the coach bag is a birthday gift from my husband. But the second one that I bought, I bought it myself. But obviously I'm going to unbox that in the Singapore vlog because I didn't buy it in Bali. I put it in Singapore. So me unboxing luxury items really doesn't mean that um, against replicas now or I'll never use a replica again. I might just drop another video from Maggie. I really have no problem. Do what works for you financially. Don't look at what other people are doing. Do what makes you happy. Do what works for you. We don't know what you're planning. Maybe you're building a house. Maybe you're building a house for your parents. Maybe you're saving for your children's school fees. Maybe like there's so many things that uh, you can do with your money outside luxury items. And if there's not, a, if 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 like you can afford to buy one, why not? I always say, like in all my replica videos, I think I always say I have nothing against anyone. I'm not in anyone's business. Let me not. Let me stop talking. I'm just gonna check out um, the ones I bought in Singapore, <laughs> guys. I bought three luxury items in Singapore. I'll explain. I'll explain. I'm gonna be honest. I'm gonna explain to you guys. But be sure to watch my Singapore video. Okay, this bag is a little um, abused because I bought this, like I said, I bought it three weeks back. I took this back to uh, Singapore thing. I'm going to unbox that side. When we got that side, I really didn't have time. Okay. <gasps> Guys, is this me? Is this me? <laughs> Thank you, baby. So this is my birthday gift as you guys know uh, on the 14th of december it was my birthday so i've been nagging <laughs> my husband like baby i really want a coach bag I, if you watched my other vlogs we always went to coach and when we got there they never really had my bag they had like the small ones but i didn't want the small one i wanted the big one and here it is so this bag cost uh 14,500 rands in um Am I zoomed in? No, I'm not. Sorry. So this bag costs 14,500 rands in um, South Africa. And we bought it here for 11,000 rands. So it was less. So we paid 11K for my coat bag. You know, I want to take... I'm going to go downstairs and like quickly get a snap of like the box and then i'm gonna come back and unbox <laughs> for instagram <laughs> i'm coming back hey guys i'm back um i did take my photos i don't know if you guys will see but i just went downstairs and i took like the packaging of um the picture for my instagram switch off my camera it's time let's do it <gasps> the last time I saw the bag, I saw it when we were pack packaging it at the shop. Oh, what's going on here? Okay. Okay, let me try. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Guys, uh...
it's in a it's in a um, dust bag. There it is. Oh my word, guys! I finally have this bag. Oh God, it's so good. Me. There she is. Here's my birthday gift. Hi. Oh. Okay. Here is my new coat bag. Obviously, it comes like with the strap, and it's still covered. What else is? Oh, that's the short strap, and this is um the long strap. But yeah, guys, here's my coach bag. I have to go home and get it and get my name stamped on it. Okay, let me show you on the inside. I wanted this whole this bag the whole year and I really wanted the authentic one. If you watch my channel, I did say like I want the authentic coach bag and there you have it. It's here. Can't believe I had to wait one flip. One full year. Okay, this is the strap. I'm just gonna put it on. Focus on this thing as bad. So yeah guys, I just wanted to um, unbox my bag with you, my birthday gift with you. Although I feel like this entire month has been a birthday gift. Like it's been, oh my god. Hey! <laughs> oh, it's mine! <laughs> it's mine! It feels so soft, it feels so good. Okay, okay. So yeah, guys. Um, uh, this was my birthday gift, as I told you, and I feel like this whole month has been. Oh, luggage is falling. I feel like this whole month has been like an actual birthday gift. It's been just so amazing, and um, I hope this vlog was not boring. I know it was not all over the place. Honestly, honestly speaking. I vlogged because I know I have a family back home that needs content, a family that needs to know where what I, what I got up to when I was on my honeymoon. And uh, you know how we do a vlog every month, but my heart was not really in it. I really wanted to live in the moment, but I would never like ever leave you guys out. So like we chose like two days vlogging, two days not vlogging and to just chill and enjoy the first month of our marriage and it's been like imagine on being on an island and it's just the two of you our phone numbers don't work like we don't have numbers for south africa you don't call like there are no problems it's just us enjoying us and being us like it's so beautiful it's a perfect perfect way to start a marriage to start a union like to start a new life together years down the line we're going to look back and tell our friends tell our families tell our kids with yo we once did this like we got married and we booked a one month honeymoon in asia and it was so beautiful i really hope you enjoyed the little um of content that i can capture i hope it's a lot because i haven't watched any of my content i just keep filming and just stopping i don't know how much i have so if you watched the video up to here please leave me a nice comment in the comment section also don't forget to subscribe guys we're on the way we're on our way to 50,000 subscribers and you know what i promised you guys once we get to 50k i'm giving you my wedding vlog my wedding video from scratch doing my makeup uh when we're putting on our rings uh the reception the decor everything so i need you guys to hit that subscribe button so we can quickly get to watch it together i did buy other stuff um at 
Victoria's Secret, but maybe I'll unbox them in the in another vlog because they are in one of these bags. I'm not sure which one. I'm so lazy to un um I'm so lazy to unpack and look for everything. But I bought that white gown. I'm gonna put a picture here. I bought the white gown and I bought um body sprays and lotion at Victoria's Secret and bait it by his own stuff. Maybe we'll show you guys when we have time. But right now I wanted to use this bag, but I didn't want to unbox without actually filming it am i unboxing it if i'm not unboxing in front of you guys oh let me show you guys the receipt where is it i know i told you guys the price let me just go get it okay so guys this is the receipt of my um, coach bag i don't know if you guys can see here it is um obviously i told you guys that i bought it in indonesia so the amount comes up to 11 million <laughs> Is it 1 million or 11 million? But it's in rupees. But I know it's in million. This is like a million rand. Baby, is it 11 million? Eh? Um, which one is that? The, the coach bag. The coach bag is... How do you count this? 11 million? Yeah, that's 11 million. 241,000. <laughs> <laughs> So here is the price. So it's 11 million, uh, 241,000, but it's in rupees, not um, um, not rents. So when you convert it, it does come up to 11,000 couple of something. So it was really under... So when you inquired at in, in Sunton, how much was it? It was, wasn't it 13 or 14? It was 14. 14,500, 14, I yes. think, yeah. Good. and we almost bought it and we almost bought it but it was so close to the wedding and i was like um we have so much to do the little money we don't know like when we'll need that money let's mm. let's wait and we i'm so glad we waited because the plan was to buy it in singapore and we saw it yeah. we didn't expect <laughs> yeah we we're gonna buy it in singapore but we found it here mm -hmm. and we found it cheaper <laughs> So yeah guys, I just wanted to share with you my um, amazing purchase. I'm so happy, like I really, really love it. Okay guys, I'm going to close off this vlog here. If you've made it this far to this vlog, I hope you really enjoyed it. I hope my vlog was not all over the place. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and thank you so much for getting me to 40,000 subscribers. We are on our way to 50,000 subbies before you leave and go back to whatever you are doing please make sure that you're subscribed we on our way to 50k just check and just make sure that you subscribe and i will see you in my next vlog which is uh, singapore which is our singapore vlog bye <laughs>